all right guys welcome back it's abby from the chairs tv back again with another video today i'm gonna show you guys how to make haitian kumas we're gonna start off with two cups of white rum today i'm using bacardi because i cannot put my hand on a white babanku guys so don't come for me all right guys right here we're gonna put two cups of pure sugar cane two cups of pure sugar cane and then we're gonna add it into the clearing and we're gonna mix it yes guys i'm mixing it on low because this blender is a little bit too powerful so i don't want it to fly off now we're gonna add three 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 fresh coconuts yes real coconuts guys real real coconut you got you don't have kumas without real coconut y'all period <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and blend it, blend it, blend it until it is blended to my likings, guys. Oh my god, those that taste cremas know that this is the bomb.com. But, guys, I did not put too much clear because I wanted it to be soft, I didn't put too much liquor this time because I didn't want it to overpower, guys. Right here, we're going to put it in. A strainer and squeeze the living juice out of that coconut the squeeze it squeeze it squeeze it squeeze it until you cannot squeeze no more honey <laughs> keep on squeezing squeezing every little drop all right now guys it's time to make that cremos <laughs> all right right here we're gonna add two cans of evaporated milk guys oh my god i love evaporated milk i love it we're gonna continue stirring that's the key of making kumas you gotta stir 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 all right guys now we're gonna put four cans of sweet condensed milk yes you probably won't see me putting everything in there but i did put them it's just i'm not about to waste y'all time because y'all already see me putting it one time y'all need to see me putting it another three times guys <laughs> now it's time to put three cans of cream of coconut this specific specific brand i love it because i don't know like i don't feel like i need to put more sugar all right guys now we're gonna add nutmeg lime zest cinnamon sticks and um star anise i guess um the nutmeg was fresh i'm the one that grinded and you already know about that lemon zest honey and um the reason why i'm putting them like that whole because i'm gonna let them sit yes you cannot not 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 let this sit all right, guys, so don't get worried about the texture. We're going to add two bay leaves. The bay leaves are very strong, so we don't need too much but two. We're going to add two, and then we're going to stir it, guys. Stir it till you can't stir it no more. Now it's time for the um, almond extract. Almond extract is so good. And vanilla extract. Guys, you can't go wrong with these two. You can't. And just keep on stirring. <laughs> All right, guys, this is what's going to make that in my stick lime juice <laughs> i added half a cup of lime juice and keep on stirring stir 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 so you can't stir it no more stir 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 till you can't stir it no more all right now we're gonna let it sit for 24 hours all right guys it's been 24 hours now it's time to strain that good must see all of that stuff that you had in it earlier trust me it's not gonna stay in there <laughs> That's what the strainer is for. Oh my God, look at how thick it is. Guys, trust me, it might not look that thick on the recording, but trust me, it is thick. Letting it stay sit overnight was the best thing. I, obviously, I covered it, but man, 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 it is so good. The smell of that fresh lemon, not lemon, but lime, the, fresh, the smell of it, so fresh. Make sure you get every drop out. All right, guys, make sure you get every drop out of that strainer now it's time to bottle them up <laughs> all right guys i use the same little bacardi bottle that i used and that is it thank you for watching